The Philippines Foreign Affairs Department confirmed that the ongoing provisional understanding with China in the Union Seoul, but the DFA's officials said these agreements are still subject for amendments amid the increasing tensions in the region. Here's the details. During the House Committee on Appropriations hearing of the proposed funds of the Department of Foreign Affairs or DFA for fiscal year 2025, the lawmaker seeks a Philippines position regarding the continuous dispute in the highly contested territory in the West Philippine Sea. House Deputy Minority Leader and Act Teachers Party List Representative Franz Castro questioned whether such provisional understanding between the Philippines and China covers Filipino fishermen in the West Philippine Sea. No, na makapangisda dyan. At ito nga, yung problema natin dito sa uh, intensifying ano no, yung ag uh, aggressiveness ng China dito sa West Philippine Sea. The DFA replied that the provisional understanding are still subject for amendments, so the Philippine government hopes that China will follow these agreements. DFA officials said that none of the Philippine territory is affected by any kind of oppositions of the Philippines in the disputed area. Just two points on the first, the understanding, uh, which is provisional, and therefore it, it can be also subject to improvement, uh, particularly concerns yung resupply of the, of the uh, yung and show. Secondly, I can say uh, that none of the national positions were affected. In other words, uh, we have uh, maintained. Uh, the national position of the Philippines on, on every. So that's what I can say. Thank you. Foreign Affairs Secretary Enrique Manalo also defended the Philippines over the latest flare released by the People's Liberation Army Air Force of China, which clearly imposes risk to the Philippine troops. Manalo asserted that the Philippines will remain in compliance with the diplomatic and peaceful means of resolving the issues in the South China Sea based on the declaration of the international laws. The DFA is always open to any discussions with Chinese government regarding China's ongoing harassment and illegal activities in the West Philippine Sea. Now, that since especially in the light of the agreement or the understandings, so you and we're trying to calm the waters, uh, incidents like this, I think, don't don't help. We spoke with China. We negotiated with China. Chang policy naman natin here on the South China Sea has always been our um, willingness to settle any differences or disputes through peaceful means, and that means through negotiation or through diplomatic methods in accordance with international law. The provisional arrangement is part of the bilateral consultation mechanism between the Philippines and China. This is also part of the dialogue between the Philippines Department of Foreign Affairs and their counterpart in China to resolve and lessen the tensions in the South China Sea. The most recent bilateral consultation mechanism between Beijing and Manila happened this July, which both countries asserted their position in the South China Sea claims. Alvin Palabello for Euro TV News.